Hey guys, welcome back to some Vitamin Y. So today is Sunday, that means we are using Shadali Bell. And I am super, super duper busy today. Like, I'm pretty much running around doing everything. I pretty much got up this morning and, uh, besides doing my usual routine of uh, rendering and getting all the videos that are already pre-recorded ready, uh, I got five, five video requests for uh, test build. So I had to go ahead and do those. Then I got to record Vibe Y, record Daily Duels, and I also got to record some more Shovel Knight because I don't have any more Shovel Knight. Then I'm also going out with my friends to locals today, so just super duper, super duper, 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 duper busy, and I drew you bell first hand. Yes! All right, well, we begin... Kind of, meh. I mean, thank God we're using Shadal, so at least I can fuse with it. But, yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and set the Hedgehog, and then the Hedgehog will be flipped up. I'll go ahead and search for the Shadal Fusion. I can fuse the, you, I can fuse you Bell with the Lizard, and uh, then you Bell will be out of my hand, set the Limit Reverse. So, that's good, because drawing you Bell is, like, the worst. Never, ever draw you Bell. Oh, okay. Holy shit. Fucking Blackwing guy going fucking ham here. Like, look at this bitch. He's, he, he, he is like... This, 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 and this, this, to do this. Oop, knocked over my cup. And it's time for Armor Master. Alright. Uh. Not right now. Sorry, uh. Recording. What's up? Oh my god, I'm trying to... I'm so busy. I'm sorry to god. I, 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 I'm, I apologize. Go ahead and get my effect. So let me go ahead and get my Shadal Fusion, of course. Uh, there it is. Put it in my hand. And then it dies. This, black, this Blackwing guy, he went ham. I'll take the 25. I guess you don't want your uh, Shura effect. Guess not. Okay. Well, I will be doing a Shadal fusion here, so. And they do have a monster that's, in, that's summoned from there, should I? Uh, it would be nice to. It's, it would be nice to get the Yuval in my hand, but it would also be nice to make a Nephilim and take care of that play right now. Uh, yes. Oh. Fuck it. Leroy Drinkin's blind space. Need to get rid of one of them. Alright. Necro's attack. That's a good hit. Alright. Uh, Shadal Fusion. Alright. You have a monster from the extra deck right there on your field, so I will be going for Nephilim. Okay, I'm guessing it's fine. So I'll go ahead and fuse Lightsworn Wolf with Dragon. And fuse into Nephilim Dragon Effect uh, Bear Effect Nephilim Effect. So go ahead and pop that. I'll go ahead and send an send another one. So I guess I'll go ahead and send a. Uh, Beast, and then bear effect. Oh, bear will be summoned to the field. So I'll go ahead and destroy that. Destroy that. Another Icarus. Well, he could have played it if he wanted to. I guess he didn't want to. I guess I don't know. Uh, beast effect. Go ahead and draw a card. Terror. Yes. Awesome. Uh. I guess I'll go ahead and just attack and destroy uh, Armor Master with Nephilim, of course, and I guess I'll just run over him, but... Uh, once again, another suck thing right now. So, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't go that far. It's not the most, it's not the most OP fusion. The most OP fusion. Oh, I'm trying to go through. It's, I probably have to say the last warrior from another planet, because he just pretty much says, "Fuck you. You don't play Yu-Gi-Oh." If you don't know what he does, look him up. 
just like, ugh. <laughs> now, Nephilim is not even what makes Shadal good. It's freaking Midrash. You know, the, the, oh my god, strong deck. <laughs> oh my god. That was the wrong deck. I am so con, just, ugh, what? <sighs> sure, sure. I'm just so fucking mixed up right now. That was the wrong deck. I was actually uh, testing that deck against uh, one of my friends, and I totally forgot to change it and set it to default. My bad. <laughs> um, no, it's it's midrash. The ability to you know hurt both sides of the spectrum. The 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 aggressive side of you know dragon rollers summoning multiple monsters and jumping the hell out of you because midrash you can only special summon once a turn, and uh. And I thought she was gonna host, but whatever. I mean, last time I dueled against her sh or him or whatever, she pretty much came at me with fucking just the tit. So I don't even know what the fuck I'm gonna be facing today. But you know what? I don't really care. Uh, and then also from the other point of view, since it can't be destroyed by your opponent's card effects, it handles the strength of hat and you know, uh, you know, the popping of uh, of moral talk in the hand. So that's the strength. Uh, that that Shadals have also the ability to have two flip cards that can handle situations really well. Lizard, uh, I believe, pops a monster and then Dragon bounces a monster. That's another thing that makes uh, the decks really powerful as well. So that's that's what that's what you should expect from decks like this. From yep. So get your noblemen's out. Okay, fortune tune. Okay. Yay, I drew terror. Oh my god. I swear to god. I wish I can go without drawing you bell all the time. So you paid a thousand life points to summon a monster like Fortune Tune. Not a big fan of Fortune Tune. I'll take Zen mains over Fortune Tune any day. Any day. So that is a lot of back row. Sure. Are there middies in here? No, I don't. Damn. Should. What's wrong with me? fuck is this? Uh, I'll chain. So I'll go ahead and bring back Hedgehog. Hedgehog will get destroyed. And I'll get his effects. I get to add a Shadal. And I totally don't mind adding a Shadal. Uh, yeah, go ahead and give me Dragon. Uh, this duel is going to take a freaking marathon because of all the back row. This video gets up to 20 minutes. I'm going to have to cut it short. I got a lot of other things to do today. There's one fiendish chain at least. Are you going to make another freaking fortune tune? Also, you forgot to gain your... Uh, uh, you need to gain 500 from fortune. You didn't gain your 500 this turn. Then you should stand by phase to gain 500 light points. Yeah, that's mandatory. <laughs> I just don't like fortune. I just don't see what it brings to the table. Oh, it can't be targeted, and when it's destroyed, it just hatches, da 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 And? It's weak as fuck, and it doesn't do anything. Shit, I'd rather go into Zen mains. Zen mains is the pressure. Zen mains is the good shit. Like, oh, but Fortune 2 can't be targeted. Like, who anybody wants to target that weak piece of shit? What the fuck is that? Never seen this card before. 
um, when this card is supposed to summon, you can target one digit and exceed monster in your guys with the tie. Uh, once we turn your tie, once you Never seen that card before. Ever. Yeah, I drew Wolf. Alright, and it begins. Effect, or are you going to chain me up again? Okay, well, I'll still get my effect. Draw two, and I will go ahead and... I'm not drawing shit right now. Because I'll go ahead and set Lizard, so I'm just going to go ahead and discard Dragon. Dragon effect. Pop this, because the fucking back row is real. <sighs> go ahead and activate Pot. I want Ultimate Nightmare? Yeah, of course I want Ultimate Nightmare. I want MST. I don't want to call the Haunted. I'll take the MST. I swear to God. Fucking back row is real. Space that. At least I'll be up on fucking resources. So, does he have any other effects? When start talking, okay. And you can... Then you could just rush. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. 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 All right. So I'm just gonna go ahead and summon dragon, and dragon will kill this bitch, piano bitch that I've never seen before. She's like in the piano. Looks weird. <laughs> uh. I'll go ahead and set the limit verse and pass. So at least I'm up on resources right now. That's good. I mean, I... Oh, that top deck, though. You saw that top deck? Yeah, it's fine. You saw that top deck? Top decked hard as fuck. Also, she didn't put anything back for, uh... Did she? For tour bus, she didn't. She didn't put anything back for tour bus. Now, what are you going into? Zen mains? That wouldn't be the smartest idea. Since I get effects when I'm destroyed by card effects, Zen mains wouldn't be the best right now. Hopefully it's not just another fucking fortune tune. Swear to God, it's just another goddamn fortune tune. Nope. It's a lie then. Alright. Sure, I'll take 700. Alright, Jim Ass Chameleon. Don't believe I have Dragon in the graveyard. Oh, yes I do. When did I put dragon in the grave? Right? Oh, when I just try to spell trap. Yes. Dragon's in the grave. Dragon's in the grave. Love dragon. Dragon's too strong. Alright, I just need to think about what the flip I want to do. I could take his le Leviathan and then start destroying this with 101. Yeah, I think that'd be a pretty optimal play. That's a pretty optimal play indeed. I'm going to go ahead and make 101. Get my effect down. Uh, put that on top of there. Attack Tart Fortune Tune once. Rip off an attachment. Go ahead. Let's see if she top decks again. Sets a monster. Alright. Did you just say it can't be destroyed? The face of the card be destroyed. Okay, period. Just attach the same material. Alright. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'll do it. Just destroy the set. Because I know. The deck she's using is a lot of flip effects, right? If 
from what I've seen, just a lot of tour guides, tour buses, and stuff. Well, your monster would get destroyed by the dark hole first, then tour bus would go off, but it's whatever, it's really whatever. What, is that monster immune to dark hole? Is this face down monster immune to dark hole? You gonna destroy that monster? Oh my god, I can't type. Or is that monster just blatantly immune to dark hole? Okay. Because if it is, you can go ahead and tell me. I didn't know. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and set you. And then we'll go ahead and kill Fortune Tomb. Go ahead. Feels good to be up on resources. Sure. Say, this doesn't let you draw. It'd be a little bit better if it did when it's destroyed to get the draw card. That'd be nice. And Pokey for 21. Being up on resources is the best. Then I can flip up Falcon next turn, and Falcon can go ahead and bring me back one of you guys in face down defense position. Another Crane Crane. Alright. Now what? Okay. So you go up to 3,000. Take 900. Oh, what's up? Hey. Draw. The hedgehog, so I'll go ahead and flip you up, get your effect, destroy you. Uh, I can make a king of feral imp. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Summon you. This card is flip summon. I get to summon one of my shadows in face down defense position. Really sucks that my beast is banished, but really, whatever. Uh, go ahead and flip someone. That effect. Go ahead and summon Hedgehog and set it. Get the damage in. Then make a King of Feral Lamp. Detach. Go ahead and get me um, uh, another Mass Chameleon. Yeah, I knew that wouldn't be enough for game. 2,000 life points left. Alright. Go ahead and overlay these two into king get this effect detach and go ahead and get me another mass chameleon ah being up on resources this feels like magic the revenge on gamer girl hey i won all right well i gotta go ahead and call episode so i hope you guys enjoy thank you guys for watching thank you guys for all the support see you guys tomorrow with you bell beat the new upgrade you've all be with Mountain Bound Creator and stuff. Look forward to it. Thanks for watching.